on the channel, what I wanted to create was that people could go and have, if they lost their faith in humanity, it would be restored by watching all of these humans from around the globe doing really everything on there is, and is an expose on something inspiring that's happening, whether it's a true story of someone, um, whether it be a kid or an adult, this is a way for us to start to see ourselves through a lens of what's possible and how, so it's great if you're not feeling well to go and literally binge watch because there's so much other stuff that, I look at media and entertainment as food, right? And how does it affect us physically, mentally, emotionally, and spiritually? So we have to ingest stuff that raises our vibration if we, as a collective society, are going to raise our vibration and do things at um, a level that is more heart-centered, that is helpful, that is creating conscious choice in the world. So I think having that is important, and conscious media is one of the best ways to inspire conscious evolution. Um, and that we need to create more of these stories. We need to share our own stories. So what's personal and, and relevant to me and from my space as a coach is really um, about nature and returning to nature. So being inside of a corporate office for so long and losing connection with my body even and earth was something that I experienced and created a lot of disconnect and disharmony for me. And uh, now I actually bring people into nature with horses to have them become embodied versions of, um, of the heart and to be able to have that whole system and creating synergy uh, at an individual level. So what's, what's important for me now is that we tell more stories about nature and animals and um, how they're here as spiritual teachers and why they're important as well. So, so in many ways, um, it's really finding these stories. It's creating them and finding these stories and creating ways that we can uh, have a place for people to go and experience this. Because I know with me, sometimes I just need to cry to get connected again, or I need to smile to remember why I'm here, to feel good here. And that's why you know I created what I did. I just wanted that experience for more people on the planet.